What's up, Wayne Barron here with Dark Effect Studios, and we are inside of Windows 10 with a brand new installation and a brand new formatted one terabyte hard drive. So what we're going to do is that we're going to actually create partitions for our hard drives. We're going to right click on our start menu, come over here to disk management. Okay, so right here is our uh, C drive, which is on a 120 gigabyte drive. Okay, we're not messing with this. This right here is connected onto a USB drive. So this right here is our backup. This is our backup that is going to be brought back over and put onto this after we have created our partitions. So the partitions that we're going to do is this right here. We're going to do a B for profile, 40 gigs, and our main is already done. So then we're going to do one for software for my projects, for images, web, media installation, which is for Adobe and 3ds Max and so forth. Office is going to go here, and then my music library goes right here. So this is what we're going to do. So we're going to right click on unallocated space. We're going to choose new simple volume. Come over here, click on next, and then we're simply going to do 40 gigs for this one. So it's going to be 40 whoops zero one two three click on next and we're going to set this at b and then click on next and this right here is going to be profile and then click on next and then finish so we're going to come over here and we're going to make sure that everything is closed so we're going to go ahead and close out this window we also got to change this one this is a d so we're going to change the drive loader on this one we're going to come over here we're going to set this at about w Click OK, choose Yes. Now we got B and C. Okay, I simply just had to unplug the, the external USB to, in order to get my D drive back. Right click, go to New Simple Volume, and then we're going to change this one, two, one, two, three for a 100 gigs. Then we're going to leave it at D drive, and then we're going to change this to Software. Click on Next and Finish. We're going to do this to the rest of them. Okay, and we are completed. So now I've got all of my drive structures set up. So I got my C, my B, D, E, F, G, A, uh, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and J. So I am now set up and ready to transfer everything back in, which I will do on the next video. Thanks for watching. Wayne Baron here with Dark Effects Studios. Y'all have a good one now. Bye bye.